Where is she? She's taking forever. She said she would do this with me. No, 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 no! Oh. Is she here? Is she following me? Who? Alice. Why? She may or may not like my awesome sweater. Well, your sweater isn't exactly within school rules. So what? It's more festive. It's more awesome, you know? Oh, are you doing it already? Yeah. Mm. We have to do it, remember? You said you would do it with me. <sighs> but I'm so tired. But come on, I don't want to do it. I'm going to go. Ow! Oh. Ugh. Fine. We'll do it. Thank you. Hi everyone, it's me, the hero, Amelia F. Jones, at your service. And I'm Maddie. No one can hear you. I'm Maddie. This is, yeah, this is Madeline. She's, where are you from again? I'm from Canada. Whatever. Anyway, we are here making this video just for you guys. It's the upcoming Italia Day 2011 out here in Columbus, Ohio. Oh yeah, I don't know about you guys, but I'm getting so pumped up for this. Hmm. Is that how you're gonna cheer? Come on, I'm gonna hear a real cheer now. Yeah. Louder. Yeah. Louder! Yeah. Oh dear God. Anyway, we are making this video because there's a few things we need to talk to you guys about. And that be the general rules for this Italia Day. I know, rules suck, we'd rather have freedom, whatever, that's something we have to do. Yeah. Gestures. Certain gestures and sayings may have a deep negative connotation and should never be taken lightly. Keep your surroundings in mind. For example, if you see a Germany or a Prussia cosplayer and a seeing hell, hell, yeah, or doing any such gesture, give them a warning. If they continue this behavior, even if it's a joke, they might be asked to leave the gathering. Bottom line, it is it, if it is inappropriate in neither the time or the place for it, you will be asked to leave. Especially since we're trying to keep this rated G to PG as possible, if you don't mind. Yeah. What you do at home in private is your own business, but we will not tolerate it at this gathering. On that same note, please refrain from wearing Nazi or even Red Army attire at the park. It is a public place where people other than cosplayers will see you. On the issue of harassment, this probably means you, France. Unfortunately, uh -huh. Unfortunately, this topic has come up several times. We shouldn't have to tell you to keep your hands to yourself, but keep your hands to yourself, please. Unless you know the person and they are completely okay with it, like if I'm able to do this to her, you should never <clears throat> you should never be allowed to touch a fellow cosplayer in any inappropriate manner. We don't care how in character you think you may be in. It like it's also in character for Russia to to like smack people around with a pipe or hungry to hit people with a frying pan. But you don't see those cosplayers actually doing that, do you? At least I hope not. If we see any of that going on and the harassed cosplayer feels distressed, you will be asked to leave, no questions asked, especially if said victim is a minor. Bad touch trio be damned, we don't want to see any bad touch touching. MINORS! Because <laughs> I know there are some of you who are. Please, if you're a minor, let us know, and if you're a minor being unsupervised, make sure that you tell us when your ride comes so that we can leave. Um, there will also be cameras around, so be sure that you have your parents' consent to appear in the photos and videos. Additionally, we're banning yaoi paraphernalia since we'll have mi minors. So, don't bring them, please. Keep your paddles at home and all those wonderful artsy, um... I'll be right back. R-E-S-P-C-T! Show them what they mean to- Ow! Please respect the other people in the area. Some people will naturally be curious and ask what we're up to, so please don't be rude to them. Some kids tend to be rude as well and will make snide remarks about our costumes. You may want to avoid that. We honestly don't need to see a grown person arguing with a seven year old. It's a little weird and kind of sad. Just a little. Weapons! We know you guys love your weapon replicas, but due to an issue as previously stated, be a yai paddle, 
We'd like for you to keep them at home until further notice. There may be a sound compromise, but keep in mind that usually weapon policies that most cons and large gatherings have, like how you normally have those little tag thingies that say, oh, this is a weapon, be careful. And just in case they're like airsoft or cap guns, please do not bring the ammo and do not fire them. I mean it. Mock fighting is strictly prohibited. For swords and knives, no live steel. This applies to the characteristic lead pipe carried by Russia and any other weaponry that would be made of metal. Wrenches, hammers, tools, crowbars, signposts, etc. If you fail to comply with this regulation, you will be asked to leave your weapon prop in the car or take it elsewhere. Should there be an incident in which this rule is ignored altogether, you will be given one warning before you are asked to leave, asked to leave the event. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which we stand, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hell yeah! As, as America pointed out, our next topic is flags. This is a big issue. We noticed the poor treatment of some of the flags people brought along to, as props. Bear in mind that the flag you carry as a prop is also the symbol of a country and must be treated with respect. You are allowed to bring a flag with you so long as you take care of it properly. We cannot stress this enough. If you bring a flag, please keep it on a flagpole or fold it neatly and place it in your bag when you're not using it for photos. I mean, for crying out loud, how hard is that? Do not sit on them or leave them on the ground. Please have respect to the nation whose flag you represent, especially if it's my flag, because I take that very seriously. I mean, hello, stars and stripes. <coughs> God, you're so. What was that for? Give me to do this. Fine. <sighs> General issues to keep in mind. Please clean up the trash. We would also like to point out that littering is against the law, and making other attendees of the gathering clean up your mess is really uncool. We'd like it if people could take initiative and pick up trash they see lying around, even if it's not theirs. In order to ensure that the park does staff feel comfortable with us returning next year, and the year after, and for as many years as we feel like doing it again and again, we cannot stress enough how important it is that you keep our area clean. He was polluting our area. Kuma. Oh my god, you remembered his name! And we have it on record! Where is a she? I thought that was Kuma Mama. Oh, Jesus. Additional reminder, please do not bring alcohol to the meetup. We like to keep it alcohol free, if you don't mind. Thank you. For parents and non-fandom individuals, Hitalia has fans of all ages, so we're fairly certain some of our younger fans will join us for the day. We have quite a few high school age friends and acquaintances due to the nature of anime and cosplay, and we know that their parents are very concerned about the safety of the event, which you don't have to worry about because the hero's going to be there, or at least the heroine. I think male self is going to be there too, I'm not sure. Pretty sure. Um, yeah. Male self will be there. There's also a high likelihood. There is also a high likelihood that normal people will ask us what we're up to. Rather than being rude to them, here are a few suggestions for attendees that easily soothe the worried parental unit and spark the interest of the average show. Number one! Encourage your parents to come along. Even in other fandoms, we love it when parents of a fan seems interested. Heritage is a really good conversation starter for older fans, so if you're well under your family tree, definitely play it up. Number two. Have a positive attitude. Smiles goes for miles. So if a little kid says something to you, smile. If people cheer and wave and holler because they like your gigantic Spanish fly, smile and wave back. That's like you're in a beauty pageant. If someone asks what kind of party we're throwing, tell them we're celebrating world peace. After all, that, that is us all be a smile. <laughs> After all, when the whole world comes together for something as amazing as Italia Day, there's no way you can get away with being sad for too long. Number three, have fun. This is the most important guideline of all. We're here to have fun, 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 fun in the partly cloudy sky from the looks of it outside. And if you do, if you are not having fun, people will notice. I will notice, and you have to deal with the hero's punishment. And that's scary. Ask her. Yeah. I'll keep her all together. Hey, 
Have a good time, make new friends, and talk, talk about, about the, the fandom. fandom. We're, We're all friends, friends here. here. Or at least pretend to be. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Alright, that's it. We'll see you guys Sunday. Can't wait to see you guys! And, yeah. Cue outro.